Well, in this competition, we've reached the group stage, Alan. Match day one. Yeah, one of those where you want to get off to a good start. Of course you do, so both sides aiming to do that. And this match is Brazil, and they play Switzerland. It's an international fixture here, Alan, that will bring back memories for you and your England career. Well, it is a proud moment. You stand there, you sing along to the national anthem, and uh, you just want to do yourself justice representing your country. And we pause now for the national anthems. Switzerland, one of the countries that has hosted a World Cup back in uh, 1954. And they looked pretty impressive in qualifying, Alan. Well, it certainly did. Only lost that one game. The last one against Portugal had to go through the playoffs, but during that qualifying, they were really impressive. Well, the supporters here. They expect a certain type of football, don't they? An intricate game, really. Yes, and uh, for the opposition, I mean, it can be incredibly frustrating. Just trying to get the ball back, you've got to work really hard, and uh, once you do, you want to make sure you don't give it away because you might not see it again for two or three minutes. This is the team chosen by Switzerland today. Stefan Lichsteiner starts with Ricardo Rodriguez in the fullback positions. Harris Seferovic is the lone striker today. start of this group the ball is rolling out and the nations are competing to try first of all to get through to the knockout phase and they cut it out good work really to read the intention of the pass it's a turnover in play And another Brazil attack here. Gabriel Jesus. Some options now for the pass. In for Neymar. Defended well. Challenges for the ball. Chance to go at the opposition with pace. Still countering here. Delivered into the box. Penalty put away. Stylishly slotted in. Yeah, it is, and uh, it doesn't normally let you down from 12 yards, certainly didn't there. Well, here's the goal again. Showing his frustrations, the manager, I'm sure he'd love to be out there playing himself, but he can't, and his team are losing now. And that has 
opened the scoring. 1 0 here. It's with Danilo. Now Casimiro. Well, they're in a good position here. Harris Seferovic. Jim Eiley. Brazil back on the ball here. Coutinho. Clever work at speed by Coutinho. Keeper not taking any chances. Not wanting to catch that one. He's punched it away. So the tournament is all set now. We know the draw. We're ready to go on match day one with every team at this stage hoping that they can go a long way in the tournament. Well, looking at the hosts, Martin, you would fancy them actually to end up topping this group if they play anything like they can. Jelson Fernandez. Jim Eiling. Maris Seferovic getting forward well as a team now. Well, he didn't stand and watch after his mistake, did he? He did the absolute opposite and got the ball back. It's with Danilo. A good control under pressure. Coutinho. It's with Gabriel Jesus. And here's the shot. He must have thought he scored from that distance. The keeper had other ideas. the corner and they get it away and he heads it out for a throw in now Danilo it's not a tall one from Danilo Ricardo Rodriguez. They could have got through there, but the defender was absolutely on top of his game. Well, if you look at the coaching manual, you don't defend like that. He's got caught too square to his man there. Paul. Coutinho! Super header, narrowly wide. Yeah, the goalie was rooted to the spot there. Is it going to be one of those days? The manager seems to think so. Look at his expression. What a chance miss that was to go level. Not often you see Brazil behind in a match because they do have so many great resources, huge population, of course, wonderful football tradition. We'll see. It'll be fascinating to see whether they can find a way to win from this position in the second half. Looking for teammates in the middle. That army. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they're after. So, real captain's contribution here with a fine goal. Was a good goal. He came at a Crucial time, I think, for his side. Captain's input there. Restarting at two nil. Now Danilo, three minutes from the referee via the fourth official, that's the decision 
regarding added time. It's looking good, this move. Well, he's cut that out well, well read. They've got a corner now. Well, no real contribution today from Neymar so far. The opposition must be absolutely delighted. They'll be hoping to restrict him to as few touches as he's seen so far. And in it goes. Good defending at the front post, but not such a good corner. Can you believe what we've seen in the first half? Half time. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? I would be happy with that first 45 minutes. It was a good goal from him, good overall performance, actually. So the second half has started at this World Cup group stage game. Brazil trail. Well, it's an unthinkable scoreline. And uh, those Brazil players have got to stick together and produce much better than they have so far. Coutinho. Good position. They've worked this attack very well. Now the referee says free kick. It's going to be a change now for the side that uh, well, they're recognising how well this central defensive midfield player played. Yeah, and we uh, recognise his defensive instincts, but I like the way he just moved the ball forward, first touch, first time to get his team on the front foot. Good defensive clearance there. Granani Chaka. Marcelo gone out for a throw. Giacca. Now Danilo. Gabriel Jesus. Jim Eiley. Free kick against Brazil. Well, it's uh, one change, and it looks like it's a case of just trying to freshen the team up a bit. And saved by the goalkeeper. Clasped it to his midriff. Gabriel Jesus. Played for the break is definitely on. Gabriel Jesus! In front of the watching world, Brazil score another World Cup goal. Yeah, that had all the hallmarks of a Brazil classic. Important for them to get the next goal, and they've got it, and they're still in the contest. Well, there's an opportunity for the winning team to shut up shop, but I'm not sure they're capable of it. Start the game 2 1. Berami. Kamani Chaka. Jim Eiling. They could pose some danger now. Good reading of the by anticipating the pass. It goes out wide again. Oh, he's good at cutting those passes out in that. He has blown and he's given the free kick. Well, the manager will be delighted with the way his team have played so far, but he's going to make a substitution here just to uh, hope 
that he can retain this lead. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Well, he scored himself a goal, and uh, you can't afford to take off players when you lose in a game like that, so a bit of a mystery, this one. And they get it away. Neymar. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. Lichsteiner, and he gives it back to it. Good defending. Now Danilo. Gemali. Berami. It's read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. That's taken the heat out of the situation for the moment with that interception. Now Fernandinho. And will it be for Brazil? Saw the goal and went for it. He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. Berami. We've seen some amazing comebacks for teams to get victory when they've... Foul by the Brazilian. And that's got the referee reaching for his pocket. It's a yellow card he's produced for the Brazilian. Yeah, a bit of a mismatch there, definite booking. Genuine attempt to go for the ball. Didn't look comfortable going into it, and it was a definite foul. Coming on to the pitch, number 22, Tyson. That's a straightforward piece of work for the goalkeeper. Roberto Firmino with good vision here. Neymar! Well saved! It's a crucial corner here, and this might be their last chance. swung in he has given a penalty he certainly hasn't ducked the issue at this late stage him off penalties but he's taken this one and scored Neymar such a skillful player and from 12 yards he's almost unstoppable every manager wants to see his team have bounce back ability as we say and he's just seen that from his players So it's 2-2 two -two now. Berami. Berami. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. To put them in front. Goal! A late goal too. And now that could be enough to win them the game. Oh, it shattered the opposition. Not sure they've got time to respond or energy to respond. Send it up high in the back of the net, just under the bar. Well, he's, he's smiling to his teammates. So difficult to stop when they uh, do finish up there. Well, a, 
very exciting climax to an exciting game. This could be the decider. Well, it could be at this stage of the match. There doesn't seem much of an opportunity to come back. I think that could be decisive. Well, if only they played like this a bit earlier, they wouldn't be in this position. They're chasing the game. It's nicely worked until that point when it broke down. And now they've got to try and regain possession. It's a good cross. his whistle for the last time well given their status in the match Alan clearly underdogs well, they'll be pretty happy with the way they played I think so yeah they can take a lot from this performance moving forward might not have got the result they wanted but they did well well he's had a very good game hasn't he well he had a good performance and uh, snatched that late goal to the win Gabriel Jesus and here's the shot <laughs> Gabriel Jesus the break is definitely on Gabriel Jesus Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. To put them in front. 